Hello, in this video, I'm going to show you how to upload variable products onto WooCommerce for your WordPress website. Variable products are products with options. This means your product page will show a drop-down list of options for your customers to choose from. These options may also have different prices and images. For this tutorial, I'm going to change the simple product I uploaded in the previous tutorial to a variable product. Click on the product name on the product listing page to get to the product editing page. Slow down the product data and change the drop down option to variable product. Next, select the attributes tab. Under name, key in the name of that drop down. Example, colors, size, etc. Under values, key in all the options of the drop-down, separated by the vertical dash. You need to make sure the box beside used for variations is checked. Then, click on the Save Attributes blue button. Next, click on the Variations tab. Then, click on the Add Variation drop-down and select the option Create variations from all attributes and click on the Go button. If any pop-up appear, just click OK. You will see your options appear. You will now need to click on each of them to add in the details. Click on the white space beside the drop-down for each option to open up the data window for that option. You can also use the Edit link. If you upload an image, it can help your customers see the right image when they select the option on the front end. You will need to set the price for this option. Repeat for all other options. If you key in the description field for each variation, the description content will appear at the space right below your options drop down at the front end. For the next tutorial, we will take our first dive into Elementor's site design functions to design the header and footer of the website.